It comes back to me in the blink of an eye. Bits and pieces. Like the dream you start to forget as soon as you wake up. Or maybe more like a nightmare. I was a hard guy for the Cloak and Dagger boys up in Ottawa. Not really an agent, more like the guy who cleans up. So what's it gonna be, Logan? The easy way or the hard way? I messed up, so what? There was no reason to do what they did. No reason at all. You always were a chump, Logan. you before the Shiva virus does its work. <laughs> Bad move. I don't like surprises. <laughs> you were part of the Weapon X program yourself. You know we all have a virus that's gonna kill us. Mm, I knew it a long time ago, Runt. <laughs> Came all this way just to watch you die. <laughs> Might be a serum hidden around here. <clears throat> I found it. They handed it over to you? You know me. I can be very persuasive. <laughs> uh, it's too bad. It's only part B. Dead useless without part A. And I do mean dead. <clears throat> Chuck, can you see this through my eyes? I have it, Logan. Hank will begin synthesizing it immediately. Oh, I'd love nothing better than to spend the next few days being new to a pulp saber tooth. But right now, I gotta go fishing in Lake Michigan. Colossus, old bud. What are you doing here? Sure ain't waiting for a bus. No, Tovarich. I have been hired to, uh, how do they say, enhance security. The new gatekeeper, huh? Well, I got a problem. The clock is ticking. Gotta get inside, pal. No ifs and buts. Professor Xavier has informed me of your situation. I am truly sorry, old friend, but I cannot let you pass to the elevator behind me. Oh? That is, if I should happen to see you. Good luck, old friend. Hi, 
Hines and Cornelius. You know who I am? Your Weapon X. We know why you're here. We always had doubts about the ethical implications of Department H's work. Doubts? <laughs> you're all hard. Please. I've written out the Part A serum formula for you. Chuck, are you there? I got the formula. Something's wrong. Xavier ain't getting through. A psionic link? It won't work here. The void is shielded. You'll have to wait till you get outside. Sabretooth may be looking for you, and he ain't bringing flowers. Just plain rude. Who died and made you miss manners? Better get scared, short stuff! You know you're no match for me! I think maybe I take care of scrap metal now. The loudspeaker said other Alpha class mutants got loose. Who are we talking about here? Magneto and Omega Red. They are gone. Enhanced security? <laughs> I'm sorry, bud, but after all this. You're gonna get fired for sure. As you say, maybe I should not give up on the day job. Uh, now that you've blown your chances of promotion, mind telling me how to take down the quantum disruption shield? Pretty please. I hear you, pal. Jack, are you there? Good news, Logan. Hank has synthesized the part B serum. Did you secure part A? Here it is. Did you get that check? Got it. But one thing, Logan. Our instruments detect a massive magnetic disturbance in an industrial area just east of where you are. Sounds like Magneto. A mess of dangerous mutants got loose and it's my fault for leading Sabretooth here. Uh, I should have taken him out when I had the chance. I gotta do something. Do what you have to do, Logan. Hank and I will work on the serum and we'll fly it down to you in the Blackbird as soon as it's complete. Good luck. Keep in touch, Chuck. Attention, mutant hunters. Attention, mutant hunters. Your contract has been activated. Retrieve all escaped mutants. Surveillance cameras have identified the intruder as a mutant known as Wolverine. You want him breathing or not, Borden? Whatever's easier, mage use. Just what I like to hear. Power up acoustic and visual enhancement units. All weapon modules are in ready mode. Weapon mod time. Mutant hunters will deploy in the troop group transports. I'll be flying cover and command in the Phantom Gunship. Yo, what do you call a mutant waving a white flag, boys? A, a moving target. target! You got it! Logan, we've been tracking Magneto via Cerebro. He is heading directly for a steel mill in the forest, due east of where you are. Makes sense, Chuck. All that iron, he'd be in his element. Correct. And in a place that might provide the means for him to neutralize the magnetic flux limiter collar that is currently holding his powers in check. So, if I don't get to him before he gets that collar off, he's gonna be chucking scrap iron at me by the metric ton? Worse yet, Logan. The prolonged dampening of Magneto's powers may have even amplified them. He may be more dangerous than ever. Yeah, rubs me wrong to ride another man's scoot without his permission. I can't be late for my throwdown with old Buckethead.
go. Not you. You think you've won, don't you? Well, you haven't. You're a dead man. Can a dead man kill? Only a fool designs a weapon without a failsafe. All Weapon X subjects were implanted with a dormant killer virus. The Shiva strain, 100% lethal. How long? For a normal human, one year. But with a mutant healing factor, who knows? Look at him. He's magnificent. He's more like an enhanced animal, living off instinct. <sighs> Not... animal. What? The open mic! He's listening to the Wrangler's headset! Not animal. I am a man! You... did this to me. You hurt me! Shut him down! Coming for you. Terminate Weapon X! That was a long time ago, Hank. I spent years wandering the woods of northern Alberta, living wild. Then I came here, to Salem Center. I stopped thinking about what those goons told me on my last day at the Weapon X facility. Start thinking about it now, Logan. The Shiva strain virus that has been dormant in your central nervous system has mutated to bypass your healing factor. It's active and incubating. Ooh. How long before it hatches, Hank? Our best estimates suggest about two days before it goes toxic. Two days? That's my birthday. Ain't that a kick in the head? Our estimates could be wrong. Maybe you ought to give me my presence now. You know I ain't taking this lying down. I didn't expect you to. That's why I've been keeping Professor Xavier in the loop about your condition. Logan, you're going back to the Weapon X facility. That's where all the answers are and the most likely place to find an antiviral serum. If it exists. They weren't insane. They wouldn't let a mutated virus loose in the world without a way to stop it. Stick this to the inside of your wrist with organic epoxy. It tells you how much time... I get the picture. It's gonna be a big help. Your estimates are wrong. Scott and Jean will fly you as far as Edmonton in the Blackbird. A bush pilot will take you the rest of the way. Good luck, Logan. My thoughts are with you. In more ways than one. You know, there aren't many airlines that will let a passenger sit up front, Mr. Logan. Don't see as there's much choice, darling. The cargo bay being full of beer and this being the only seat. in the airstrike. Give up, Logan. This is... senseless. You, of all my foes, I respect the most. For you have integrity. And you have honor. I ain't forgetting that you ripped the adamantium out of me once. Nothing respectful about that. And now, we duel again. Even with my powers tempered by this cursed device, I am far more powerful than you. I didn't come this far to take a rain check, Magneto. I came to rumble! Get scarce if you know what's good for you, girly. You looking for a ride to the Xenon building? How'd you know that? Maybe you are a good guy after all. I owe you 
one, Wolverine. I'm backing your play. under my control. Except for Sabretooth, of course. He did it for money, and for the pleasure of causing you pain. You set this up? What for, Yuriko? Don't you know I'm dying? Revenge, you fool! I wanted your death to be in my hands. You, who are bonded with the adamantium process invented by my father. You, who stole my legacy. You'd want the adamantium back that bad? Come and get it. Like it or not, you're going back to the void. You must hurry, Wolverine. The virus is taking hold. Savor this small victory. It would be your only one. Logan, there is too much magnetic interference where you are for Rogue to home in on you with the Blackbird's instruments. Any ideas, Chuck? Make your way back to the city, to the top of the Xenon building. There's a navigation beacon we can home in on. I'm out of here. death you will know, Logan. I have forsaken my humanity for revenge, and I will see no end of pain. Only an eternity of cold replacement parts and the smell of hot solder. You have won, Logan. For this Rogue will be with you soon, Logan. Hang in there. Sugar, you look like something the cat dragged in. Best have a slug of this here serum that Hank mixed up for you. It's you, the little helper, Rogue. <laughs> Nasty. You didn't bring me anything frosty to wash it down with, did you, darling? I'm the pilot, not the cabin attendant, big boy. You ready to go home? Can't ever go home again, darling. Just take me where I can put my feet up on the table and nobody cares. Reasons? Hell, maybe we all have our reasons. Ain't none bigger than revenge. Deathstrike became its slave. Revenge is a twisting, searing fire that burns deep in your belly. Take it away and you're left to face up to the reality of who and what you are. Revenge? I still want more. And maybe that's just as well. you want. He seems rather uncontrollable. Yes, he is the one I need. A pure survivor. Truly one of the strong. Begin making preparations. 
for my newest horseman. The loudspeaker said other Alpha-class mutants got loose. Who are we talking about here? Magneto and Omega Red. Omega Red. Omega Red. How you doing? Chuck, can you hear me? I'm at the base. Excellent news. Yeah? Well, hold fire on the celebrations. Security looks tighter than one of Gene's costumes. Quite. Okay. Proceed with caution, Wolverine. I have reason to suspect that there are others interested in obtaining the information you seek. Others who bear you ill will. They're gonna have to get online, Chuck. But thanks for the tip. Take him down! Am I supposed to thank you, or are you just a lousy shot? Let's just say, it's not your time to die. Yet. You answer to someone else, don't you? We all answer to a higher authority. Is that not so? You're not quite human, are you? You should talk. Here comes a real classic. This one I like. It's quiet. Too quiet. <laughs> I love the classics. It's quiet. Too quiet. That's why it's a classic. It's, it's great. All right, good. Hold on, please. Oh, it's fun to pretend, isn't it?
easy there, buddy. You picked a bad day to come sneaking up on me, bub. I'd say you straight off your home turf a bit. Heard about the big bust out at the void. So I, uh, rode out here in the chartered bus along with the other superheroes who can't fly or teleport. Right. And my Aunt Tilly body doubles for Madonna. Can you use a hand here? I hear you're ramping up for a showdown with Magneto. Well, amongst other things. If you want to help, deal with this chaos till damage control gets here. Yeah, sure. I got me a date.